So, Hogwarts Legacy is out, and I've been playing it a little bit here and there. So far, the exploration's been pretty good. Combat and magic casting, pretty satisfying. PC performance is dog water. I'm talking like frame stuttering and drops down to 10 FPS, and that's on my GTX 3070. And seriously, NVIDIA cards were not made to run this game, guys. Like, it's not happening. It, it's not bad by any means, but it's probably one of the safest games that I've seen in recent years. Uh, what do I mean by that? So, picture modern gaming, right? Take a second, like, really think about it. What tropes have you seen popping up in almost every modern game today? Thinking about it? That's the game. That's Hogwarts Legacy. I can almost guarantee you, whatever you thought about, it, it's in here somewhere. You know, you get the map screen, get that gear and gear score, the one-note personality characters, the random challenges that are just, hey, kill X number of this thing. You know, the 100 completion... 100% completion stuff that uh, slowly walking behind the guy that just spouts exposition at you while you're slowly making your way to whatever objective you're going to and you know the characters that just absolutely flat out tell you the solution to the puzzle while you're trying to figure it out like, seriously am I the only one that's sick of that shit like, I'm in the process of sitting there figuring out the puzzle and then my character just starts throwing out the solution like stop giving me the hints if I wanted the hints I'd fucking ask for them at least give me a setting give me like the shut the fuck up setting like where the main character just says nothing unless they're spoken to in direct dialogue because I'm I'm very sick of this specifically like it's it's really kind of sad it's a decently built game it's got some fun potential you know it's a good setting established world it's just one of those play it your way games you know what i mean like what purpose does level serve in the sandbox like why are these enemies level what does it do for you what purpose does my gear have to do with it like what does the gear do for you why do i need to wait real time for my components to- I gotta wait 10 fucking minutes for this fucking stupid plant to grow. Like, does any of this add to the gameplay? No, it bloody well doesn't. So why is it in the game? What purpose is it serving? The fact that I can't reasonably come up with an answer to that question is just, you don't need it in the- just pull it out, just take it out. We don't- we don't want it. All in all, it's not a bad game. At its worst, it's exceedingly mediocre. At its best, it's, well, for lack of a better word, magical. Were I to give it a score, I'd give it a shaky 7 out of 10. It barely tip in the scale. We're talking like a 6.9 rounded up. Actually, we'll knock it down to 6 until they fix the PC performance. It's inoffensive in almost every way, but yes, thanks to that, it gets no points for taking risks or for innovating gameplay in any way, shape, or form. Anyway, guys, this has been York, and this has been Hogwarts Legacy.